Back. After giving birth, many women experience sadness, anxiety, and begin to care less for themselves. All of these can be symptoms of postpartum depression, which the CDC says impacts one in eight moms. Camila Williams spoke with a mom and a family nurse practitioner about a new oral medication that could help new moms during a challenging time in their life. Motherhood wasn't easy for Leah Giddens. With my postpartum depression experience, it was very different with both of my children. When Giddens gave birth to her son in 2016, she says she didn't experience symptoms until a year later. I felt like I was in a in a pit that I couldn't get out of. And in 2022, she had her daughter. The challenges came along after. She says the new postpartum medication coming out is exciting. We have access to something new and different to try. I don't want people to get the impression that that's just going to fix everything. This month, the FDA approved the first oral treatment for postpartum depression called Zoranolone before the IV injection was available, but access was limited. Kristen Vaughn with Midwives of Macon says new moms would be seen almost six weeks after giving birth. ACOG, American College of Obstetricians and Gynecologists, has actually recommended that we change this sort of paradigm of the traditional six-week in-office visit to maybe consider incorporation of maybe virtual or telemedicine to check on our mamas at two to three weeks. Vaughn says screening the new mom would determine their next steps for treating postpartum she says she makes sure to tell moms about what resources are available now, like the Postpartum Support International. That includes a crisis hotline. It includes support groups that are free um, that you can join virtually or, of course, in person. Giddens says soon-to-be moms should have a postpartum plan. How are you going to feed yourself? How are you going to eat? How, who's going to hold the baby if need be while you take a shower. But Vaughn and Giddens agree that being a new mom can be tough, but you don't have to do it alone. Camila Williams, 13 WMAZ News. The medication won't be available until October.